Hello everybody, it is I, Daniel Kamori, Vampire Bats Extraordinaire, and welcome to a kinda of a different stream, kinda, kinda, not a stream really, I just think, uh, as you all might know, there are some new packs in uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel, some very special packs for the World Championship Series 2023 which are the, about Legendary Dark Magician, which comes with uh, sleeves, I mean card protectors, and uh, wallpaper for your opening screen of the Legendary Dark Magi Magician of Dark, sorry. And uh, the same for the Legendary Dragon of White. Now, these special bundles come with five Master Packs each. Um, to be honest, it's not a, it's a weird deal, you get the sleeves, you get the, hey, maybe by the price of sleeves and icons, it's uh, almost, eh, it goes almost to the same price, maybe it's a good deal or not, I don't know, it's fun, so I'm gonna buy it, and uh, I figure since I'm buying and pulling some random cards with zero expectations, I might as well share with you guys here, on stream and on YouTube, where you're supposed to watch this, so like and subscribe so you like more card opening, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm not a pack opening channel. Now, these two cards, I'm not sure they exist here in Master Duel, I don't think they do. Now, they're very simple Xyz monsters, I think Legendary Magician of Dark, it's two level 7 monsters, two level 7 spellcasters, and the Legendary Dragon of White is the same for two, uh, two level 8 or two, le uh, two level 8 dragon monsters, I'm not sure exactly, but they do have the same effect, which is, if these cards if this card attacks directly, attacks, not sure if it's directly, directly or not, but attacks and reduces your opponent's life points to zero, you win the match. A very fun, a very fun effect, isn't it? Eerie Master Duel doesn't make sense because it's best of one, so that's why I'm saying they probably don't exist here in Master Duel. Uh, even the TCG, again, it's just a commemorative card. It came out in World Superstars back way back then uh, it's a fun effect unfortunately it's an effect that has a very different counter which is in the TCG in real life you can just give up anytime so when your opponent if you see your opponent is going to summon that thing is going to attack before they attack you just surrender and you can continue on to match so it's an effect that doesn't really work when we can't surrender all the time but nevertheless they're iconic monsters there's also the, the victory dragon victory V which has the same effect that based on that but enough history lesson, how about we open some packs? First off, yeah, Legendary Magician of White. Here I go. All right, what am I gonna, ooh. Is it a guarantee you are, I, I wonder. Hmm, let's see, let's see. First master pack, as you know, anything can be in here. Not sure if the cards in the legacy pack can be in here, but who cares about those? Let's see. A, a new one. Ooh, a super two. Ah, Pendulum Paradox. And Whoa! Whoa! Tripic, triple Tactic Stallion. Unfortunately, I do believe I only have three, but damn, what a pull. What a pull. All right. Nice. They gotta know. They gotta know this is for YouTube. This is being streamed on. Streamed on? This is being streamed. And ooh. The left arm, mm, look at that beefy left arm, just like mine. Ah, ah. You see, <laughs> my beefy left swing, all right. Next pack, God. Oh, this opening already went pretty well. If I already have three triple tactic style, I'll just, it's just free dust. It doesn't like free dust. All right, nothing special. Ooh, Morphonic Rob, Remote Hand and Comic Hand. Alright, so apparently this is the one that has actually has a new R, not an unexpected new R, we'll see. Oh <gasps> Alright, they know they know this is for YouTube. They know, they know, they know. Oh, it's gotta be rig. Whoa! 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 <laughs> Dark magician in the legendary Magician, dark magician of dark or black or whatever. Damn, damn. Then Zora, wow, wow. No, 
All right, let's carry on. Daniel, don't do it. Save the jams. No way, I'm doing it for content. For content. All right, and I got nothing. All right, three URs. Not bad, not bad. And the sleeves, the icon, and the, the wallpaper. Nice, nice. Not bad, not bad. Not bad at all. Again, I'm expecting nothing at all. So the fact that I got some UR, not bad. Okay, now let's go. Five more packs. This is the one I actually like because I'm a huge sucker for um, for blue eyes. Let's see. Can we get some URs? Oh, let's go. Apparently not. But uh, we weren't expecting a UR on that previous pack, and um, we got three, so... Mm. Wow, I think it's, it's the second Reptia Egg we get in these packs. Damn, I have no idea what this card is. Not gonna... Re Ooh, too long, did not read. Alright, next pack. Hope you get the Luster Blebu. Ooh. Let's see if it is. Nope. Nope. No sorry. Alright, next pack. Ooh, a new R. Okay. I mean SR, not UR. SR. Live Twin. And DDD Wave King Caesar. Okay. 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 Not, not bad. Let's see. Ooh, ooh, another hidden SR. Okay. And another one. Ooh. Damn. All right. These are good cards. I think I already have a playset of Lina, the Light Charmer, but it's a very good generic, Light Generic. And Book of Eclipse. This card actually is going to make is gonna be really handy when Kashtira comes out in a couple of months, maybe? Damn. All right, let's see. I swear if you pull a Royal Red Shinjo Fart, I might smash my keyboard. I wouldn't count on that. That's impossible, because I don't think I'm going to pull any more URs. What? Oh, no. No, as you can see, no URs this time. It's rigged. It's rigged. They know. They know. <laughs> All right, not bad. Book of Eclipse. Book of Eclipse. That's something. All right. And with that, there we go. There's the... I'm gonna unlock some secret packs, who cares? Okay, and with that, there's the pulls of the WCS uh, Championship. In case you don't know, hope you guys are already selecting a team to share. I've selected Team 7 from North America because I think this is the team that actually has the highest chance because Jesse Cotton and someone else there, I don't know. But Jesse Cotton is a very powerful player, so, or so I heard. So that's the team I'm rooting for. What team have you selected? What team are you rooting for? Please leave a comment down below if you like or comment right now on chat if you're watching this live. Okay, and that is the end of opening. I'm not actually going to play Yu-Gi-Oh! So I'm going to switch game. And if you're watching this on YouTube, I'll see you next time.